This is a Canon Star Rider 70. Uh, this was made probably in the late 90s or mid 90s, maybe early 90s. Uh, this is before computers were cheap enough to use as word processors. Okay, this de device includes a nice screen so you can see what you're typing. You can actually type everything out what you want. Um, it's got a floppy drive uh, so you can save your work uh, and integrated printer. And nothing on this side. Okay, so one of the features of this thing is besides it's kind of compact and small, uh, is it does fold up and it has a carrying handle. Okay, so if you use the carrying handle, uh, you can travel to your place of work or your business thing and do some typing. Isn't that great? Okay, so again there's a floppy drive, there's a contrast knob and a power button. And I can see the top flipped open. Uh, you can see in there there's a little Canon cartridge um, that you can replace. It looks kind of new, which is strange. Okay, so let's uh, get the power cord out and turn it on. Okay, uh, here we are at the back of it. Uh, it just has this little uh, cubby hole. Uh, pops open somehow. There it goes. And it's got the power cord in it. Uh, it's also got a little adapter keyboard. I think you can plug an extra external keyboard in. Okay, and we're back around front. So, since this is really old, uh, we're going to plug it in slowly here. Okay, and nothing happened, so that's good. Uh, the last thing you want to have happen is anything when you plug it in. Okay. So, you're going to flip the on button, which is back here. And it comes to life. Okay, let's change the contrast a little bit so we can see what we're doing. Okay, press any key. Keyboard is great. Responsive, it's just like a brand new keyboard. Okay, let's see, this one does not have a floppy disk installed. Let me find a floppy disk. Okay, I uh, just got the Star Rider 80 floppy disk. And let's get that action shot. Yeah. Okay. Let's try to save. Okay. And it says disk not ready. Okay. So it looks like the disk drive is broken. Some new noise. No noise and no lights. That's disappointing. But no matter. If you're saving to a floppy disk on this thing, you have a problem. Okay, I uh, just the tripod a little bit. So let's pop it open. And let's see, on here it tells you the size. This is legal. Uh, 
Let's see. Not quite sure how to get the paper to go in. Huh. It's got a triple X key. Nice. Uh, let's see. It wants me to click undo. Okay, well, let's just roll it in manually. No, it's not going. Let's do it the old fashioned way. going to do is there's a print, press code 2, print text, print pages, number of quality, that's pretty good. Check paper, press return to start. Come to life. Okay, so that looks like that doesn't work. It's too bad. Okay, no floppy, no print. Not sure what else we could do. Even the caps light, light doesn't work. Uh, there's a disk utility. Play around with it. Disk not ready. Undo. I can't believe how blurry this thing is. Okay. Uh, again, with no good printer and no floppy drive, I'm not sure what you'd even do with this anymore. Um, I'll probably just sell it up on eBay or something. I'm sure it's good for something. Somebody will want it. And that's all for this video. Thanks.